Hello! So, after a long hiatus, I decided to talk about the Skylanders Giants box that I have here. It's the 3DS version and it was released for the Latin American market. Here, right now, I'm showing you a little more of the box. The box features some expansion packs hidden in toys, but it also shows the amount of Skylanders that there are in the game, which can be unlocked by owning the toys. There is also this new gimmick of the giant Skylander, which this box comes with one. And now it's time to open the box. So the first thing that we have here is the envelope that has cards and all stuff. Here I showed you the game, the game box, the game card and the instructions, which are pretty minimalistic. Now here we have the gimmick of this box, which are the toys. There is the portal and oh no, the box came without the USB cable, like the other version had. Let's look at the Skylanders. Here is Cinder, which looks like a Spyro. Here is Pop Fizz, I don't know what it is. And Tree Rex. What a lame name, but it's a really good looking design and very detailed too. Now here are the cards and some QR codes for the online game. One for each character. They look pretty nice. And a poster that has all the characters listed. So here, as always, I order them at the top of each corresponding one. The portal uses three AAA batteries needed for the 3DS version. Here I'm showing you the game. This is how it starts. I actually really like this game. It's pure platforming, not like the Spyro's Adventure, which was more like a beat'em up game. Even though it, it is not really polished compared to the other one, I find this to be better than the other one. I had more fun with it and I even bothered to complete it. Right now I'm showing you how to use the characters in their portals. Here's my favorite. The giant Skylander glows in the dark, so it looks really nice. Okay, I'm gonna leave you with the direct feed audio from the game.
That's all for today. Thank you for watching.